Welcome to the Fundamentals of Architecture series. This series of lessons will help you with setting up Revit project standards through a series of hands-on exercises. Build the skills you need in a structured environment. Now let's take a look at the exercises included. The Revit Project Standards Lesson Series consists of seven exercises as follows. Exercise 1 takes a look at selecting the right project template to begin a project. Exercise 2 takes a look at setting the project units, whether it be imperial or metric. Exercise 3 looks at modifying a dimension style for use in a project. Exercise 4 is about creating a new sheet to host model views for documentation. Exercise five takes a look at creating a title block from scratch. Exercise six talks about inserting that title block that you created in exercise five into a project. And exercise seven concludes by creating your own custom project template. With that, let's take a look at next steps. I would like to make you aware of two Autodesk resources. The first resource is the Autodesk Education Community, where you can access free software for both students and educators for titles like Autodesk Revit featured in this series. The website address is www.students.autodesk.com. Registration is required to access the free software using either your personal email address or your school issued email address. The second resource is the Autodesk Digital STEAM Workshop. It's hands-on, project-based learning across multiple industries such as architecture, engineering, and entertainment. The website address is www.digitalsteam.autodesk.com. Registration is required to download the free learning resources using your Autodesk ID created from the Autodesk Education Community. You will find the Fundamentals of Architecture series under the Subject pull-down menu, Architecture link. Assets include step-by-step -step instructions, data sets, and videos. This concludes this lesson overview summary. Thank you for watching.